Today we're going to be installing part number 87451 on a 2008 Chrysler Town & Country. Okay, we're over here on the driver's side frame rail and there are three attaching points. There's one there, one there, one there. So we're going to need to remove all three of these bolts. All the hardware for the hitch is actually already in the frame of the vehicle, so there are going to be no uh, bolt kit that comes with the hitch. But again, it's this one, this one, and this one need to be removed. And if we go over here to the passenger side, we're going to go ahead and have to uh, take the exhaust off the hanger to access the passenger side bolts. You can kind of see there's one here towards the rear, towards the bumper, and then one a little bit more forward as well. So we're going to need to remove those bolts. As well. First thing to do is to go ahead and remove the exhaust off the rubber hanger here. Gonna give us a little bit more room to, to get the bolts out of the frame. We're gonna go ahead and remove the bolts from the frame now. some models on the driver's side here there's a, a plastic mud flap that will need to be removed um, this particular model did not have that in place the bolts removed from the frame we can go ahead and put the hitch up into position make sure to be on the passenger side we get the hitch up and over the exhaust and the hitch can kind of set on the exhaust itself to hold it in position while you put the other side up. We just want to hand tighten the bolts at this time. Okay, with the hitch hand tightened up into position, we want to go ahead and push the hitch all the way over to the driver's side as far as possible to allow for maximum clearance with the exhaust over here on the passenger side. And with the hitch shoved all the way over, we can go ahead and tighten our bolts down. the bolts tighten down we can go ahead and torque the bolts down. The smaller M10 bolts get torqued to 53 foot-pounds and the larger M12 bolts get torqued to 92 foot-pounds. Okay, with the bolts torqued down, we just want to go ahead and put the exhaust back on its hanger, and uh, that will conclude the installation. Okay. And with the exhaust hanger reattached, uh, the installation is complete, and this will conclude installation of part number 87451 on a 2008 Chrysler Town & Country.